We're now going to begin the awards portion of our concert tonight. Our first awards for tonight are our Bandcamp scholarships. Um, for many, many years, Benton has sent a large number of students to the Henderson State University Band Camps. Uh, and each year, our boosters very, very graciously hand out scholarships to students that are interested in attending. And though uh, the cost, they try to keep the cost as low as possible, it helps tremendously for these students to be able to attend the camp year after year um, with boosters. Uh, our first scholarship award winners are our two full scholarship award winners. And these go to Tyler Poor and Elizabeth Johnson. Our half scholarships go to Hannah Breeden and Marcus Tricky. And our one quarter scholarship winners are James Eckert, Jenny Bowen, Tyler Oswald, and Amanda Oliveira. Applause for all of our Bandcamp Scholarship winners. You can go sit down now. Our next scholarship is also a Bandcamp Scholarship, but it's a very special one. For you, those of you that don't know, uh, several years ago, we lost a band member due to a very tragic accident. His name was Daniel Magnuson. He was a tuba player in this band for a very short time, um, and he is greatly missed in this program. Each year, his family uh, provides one band camp scholarship that is awarded based on character. Daniel was a very dedicated, loving, dependable person, and we wanted that reflected in his award. And as I said, this is generously provided by his family in his honor. And when we select a person to this, for this award, we want them to demonstrate those characteristics as well, to be very hardworking, uh, to be very dependable, to be someone um, who is of good character, and someone who does their best to help those who are around them. And this year, we're happy to award that scholarship to Kyle Burkett. Our next scholarships um, are scholarships that are going to people who are going to continue on in music, whether that be in education or just to play in college band. It was really tough this year. We have a really outstanding senior class. Um, at, as if you couldn't tell by performers like Brad and by the small ensemble that performed for Elegy for a Young American, we have some outstanding musicians and outstanding leadership within this band in our senior class. I'll tell you a little bit more about all of them later. Um, but I had to select only three of them um, to award scholarships to today. And these are all different types of scholarships. So I'll explain a little bit about each one. The first is the Bill Lloyd Memorial Scholarship. And this is given in honor of Bill Lloyd, who used to be a band director here at the junior high. And it is something that is awarded each year by our band boosters. It comes with a $500 cash prize that will be uh, applied toward their scholarships for their school. This year's winner is not only an outstanding musician, but an outstanding individual. Um, this person has been a section leader for two years, I believe now. Keeps everything together in a section that can tend to be hard to keep together, uh, our percussion section. This person also has volunteered their time for the last two seasons to play with an adult concert band, the Little Rock Wind Symphony. And he's so good that they've asked him to come back while he's in college as well. Um, he is an absolutely outstanding both academic and mu uh, music student. This award goes to Richard Spencer Cole.
Our next award is the Phi Beta Mu Award, and this is awarded by a group that I am a member of. Um, it's an organization of outstanding band directors. And this award it is awarded based on uh, musical ability, continuing on in music at the college level, um, someone who's also very dedicated to band and who helps out with everything that we have around. Um, this particular person um, is a three-year All-Stater, which is our highest award with musicians. Um, she has been an outstanding section leader during concert band, and she also was an outstanding section leader on our flag line, which is a very, very difficult job. Um, she's an absolutely fantastic player, and this award goes to Nikki Castillo. Our final scholarship is the John Philip Sousa Award, and this is given with a cash prize by our boosters of $1,000. That last one that Nikki got was $500 as well. I forgot to mention that. Um, this is our largest monetary award, and it goes to an absolutely outstanding musician. Um, someone who stepped up to be drum major, someone who worked extremely hard to be able to stand up in front of you and perform a solo with the band today, which is not something we ask of just anybody. Um, he's an outstanding musician and an outstanding person. This award goes to Brett Fugier. we have to recognize this senior class. As I said before, they're absolutely outstanding. They have been wonderful leaders, they are wonderful people, and I look forward to what they have to give to society in the future. Um, these are the kind of people that you want out there, okay? And you have done an absolutely fantastic job of raising them. Thank you so much, parents, for loaning them to me for three years and to letting me have them in rehearsal every day for an hour and a half and to have their whole lives during marching season <laughs> because you know you don't see very much of them during marching season. Um, I'm so pleased to be able to honor them tonight. We're going to honor each of these students individually. I'm going to tell you where they're going to school next year, what they're majoring in, if they decide it, and what scholarships they will be receiving. You'll also notice that they will be receiving a statue. This is a tradition that was started by Mr. John Webb before I came here, but each of these statues is, is customized to their instrument that they play, and it's a big deal. <laughs> they, they're really excited to be able to receive these statues. Okay, our first graduate is Cameron Bowden. Cameron will be attending Lyon College next year, majoring in political science and history, and he has received both academic and music scholarships. Our next graduate is Hannah Breeden. <laughs> Hannah will be attending Henderson State University next year, majoring in music education and psychology, and she's receiving both academic and music scholarships. <laughs> Our next graduate is Kyle Burkett. Band and academic scholarships. Our next graduate is Lindsay Burns. Lindsay is going to be attending Arkansas Tech University, majoring in nursing, and she is a distinguished scholar. Next is Nikki Castile. <laughs> Nikki will be attending Henderson State University, majoring in early childhood education and minoring in music, and she's receiving both academic and music scholarships.
next is Chris Crownover. Chris will be attending the University of Arkansas at Monticello next year, majoring in criminal justice and re receiving academic scholarships. <laughs> next graduate is Zach DeYoung. Be attending uh, Washita Baptist University next year, and he said that tonight we can vote on what his major is going to be. So we'll have ballots available out front for you guys to vote. He's taking suggestions. Next is Brad Fugier, as I've told you before. Brad will be attending Henderson State University, as I said before. And he will be majoring in music education and is receiving both band and music or band and academic scholarships. <laughs> Next is Joey Garden. <laughs> Joey will be attending Lyon College and majoring in music composition this next year. He's uh, received some very prestigious academic scholarships that he doesn't want me to read the names off of. Um, and he will be greatly missed as our outstanding pianist for this group as well. <laughs> Next is Austin Gray. Austin will be attending Arkansas Tech University majoring in nuclear engineering, and he is also a distinguished scholar. <laughs> Next is Taylor Harris. And Taylor, who I think that's probably the first time I've actually called him by his real name, because in band he goes by Bob. I'm not sure why, but uh, Bob will be attending Arkansas Tech University next year, majoring in psychology, and he's receiving academic scholarships. <laughs> next is Sarah Langley. attending Henderson State University next year, majoring in music education and psychology, and she'll receive band and academic scholarships. <laughs> next is Nick McKinley. <laughs> Nick will be attending uh, University of the Ozarks next year, majoring in biology, and he received a Commitment to Excellence scholarship. <laughs> next is Eli Nehus. <laughs> Percussion get the biggest statues, if you'll notice. Eli will be attending the University of Arkansas next year, majoring in engineering. Uh, he's a University of he received a University of Arkansas fellowship as well as the Governor's Distinguished Scholarship. <laughs> next is Jordan Nett. University of Arkansas. Um, he's also going to let us vote on his major. And he is a Governor's Distinguished Scholar and a Chancellor's Scholarship. <laughs> Next is TJ Nichols.
he told, we used these chips for marching band and he had warned me that he had a bunch of them in his truck. I didn't know it was that many. <laughs> Thank you for returning them. Uh, TJ will be attending Henderson State University next year, majoring in business and music, and he's receiving music and academic scholarships. <laughs> next is Clint Paul. Next year will be attending the University of Arkansas, majoring in engineering, and has received leadership scholarships. You guys are going to have to scoot down that way a little bit. I'm running the room over here. <laughs> Shuffle on down. Next is Allie Porterfield. University of Louisiana Monroe next year, majoring in atmospheric science. She received the President's Distinguished Scholarship. <laughs> next is Blaine Sadler. <laughs> Blaine will be attending Hendricks College next year. Uh, enrolling in the pre-pharmacy program, and he is a Governor's Distinguished Scholar. <laughs> Next is Richard Spencer Cole. Next year, Richard will be attending Henderson State University, majoring in biology and minoring in music, and he's received music and academic scholarships. <laughs> Next is Matt Thomas. Next year, Matt will be attending UALR, majoring in physical therapy. Next is Emily Warwick. Emily will be attending Arkansas Tech University next year and doing pre-pharmacy. Our last graduate, Mr. Cody Yates. Uh, next year, Cody will be attending Arkansas State University, majoring in chemistry slash pre-med, and he's received the A-State Pride Scholarship. Please give another hand for all of our graduates. Okay, we have one more thing tonight. Um, this has been a fantastic year, and so we thought we, would, we the leadership of the band, would uh, give Ms. Labo a present for, as a thank you for all the great things that she's done for us this year. But naturally, we didn't know what to get, so Byram's mom went shopping for us. <laughs> and um, she got to this spectacular prize, which Richard should be bringing out now. It's, it's a thing that you can put stuff in. <laughs> so I hope you enjoy it.
Now Cody Mansfield has something to say. Okay, so this semester, me and eight other people have gone through a really tough class called AP Music Theory. Not really the best class, but it's been fun. So if I can get all the AP Music Theory kids up here, stay with me, please. We got you a poster, and we all signed it that says APMP, because that's our rapper name. And it says, it has all of our names on it, and it says, love the theory kids. So that's for you, because you're such an awesome teacher. I have to buy new ones every year. I hoard them. 